Hi, I'm Julie Clark. Although my own babies are now entering their tween years, I've picked up some valuable tips and tricks along the way for getting the most out of watching Baby Einstein videos together. Unlike traditional television or video, the Baby Einstein DVDs are meant to be interactive, like a book. I'd like to take a few minutes to show you some of my favorite ways to use this video to interact with your baby. You've probably noticed that these original videos are almost entirely music. There's very little talking. This lets you, the parent, and your child become the real stars of the show. So don't be afraid to talk about what you see, ask questions, hum along, <laughs> or just rock together to the music. Whether you have a brand new infant, a baby who's just discovering how to sit up, or a spirited toddler, <laughs> a number of simple activities can enhance the experience of watching Baby Einstein videos together. I've also come up with some great activities to carry into the big world outside. Every baby's different, so just pick and choose the activities that seem right for you and your family. As you know, babies not only enjoy listening to music, they love to make music, too. Here are some ideas you and your baby can use to make music along with Baby Beethoven and the Baby Einstein Music Box Orchestra. <laughs> When babies first begin setting up, the world becomes a completely new experience for them. Suddenly, they can see so much more around them and reach out to enjoy a wide range of movement. Once your baby can sit up, even if he still needs a little help from a pillow or a parent, try placing a bowl upside down in front of him to bang on. Give him a wooden spoon to use as a drumstick and listen to him happily bang away. Also talk about loud and soft sounds with your little drummer. Show him how to tap gently to make quiet sounds and harder to make big loud sounds on his drum. Look, Miles, loud, soft. Beethoven has great examples of loud and soft music. Listen together and say shh, soft during the quiet parts. Then clap loudly and announce Loud, loud, loud when the music crescendos. Use your TV's volume control to experiment with loud and soft sounds with your baby. For more music making fun, select the Making Music Together option on the DVD menu. Then strike up the band. One of my girls' favorite activities was join the band. I always kept a box of toy instruments in the house for them to explore. Maracas, keyboards, drums, and tambourines are all great for babies who are able to shake and bang. I'd cue up a song and let them jam along with the Baby Einstein Music Box Orchestra. Once your child's old enough to understand that each instrument has its own name and sound, you can help them match their instruments to the instruments they see on the video. You wanna try? Good job. Pause the video each time you and your baby spot a new instrument. Then try to find a similar one in your own music box. Yeah. Talk about each instrument and the sound it makes as your baby plays along. Making your own instruments is another way to explore new sounds and add some variety to your music box collection. One of the simplest instruments to make is a plastic bottle shaker. Just fill a clean, dry plastic water bottle with beans or rice or anything that makes a nice shake-shake sound. Older toddlers will love to help you place the beans in the bottle. Be sure to close the lid tightly and check that nothing leaks out. 
If your baby's hands are too small for a water bottle, plastic salt and pepper shakers work great too. Another easy homemade instrument is a pots and pans drum kit. As you might imagine, this isn't a good activity for quiet time, but it can be a wonderful outlet for an energetic baby. Lay out an assortment of pots, pans, and bowls, and give your drummer a wooden spoon to rock out. And this. When my own daughters began walking, I remember tying bells on their shoes with ribbon and letting them jingle and stomp to the music. There simply is no wrong way to make music together. Just keep listening, talking about, and enjoying all the new sounds your budding musician creates. Once your baby can stand up, you have a perfect dance partner. Let her stand on your feet as you bounce and sway to the music. My kids also loved imitating the movements of the toys and animals they saw. Together, you can gently twirl like a top, march like a robot, waddle like a chicken, and pop up and down like a jack-in-the-box. Try all sorts of silly moves together. <laughs> You can also talk to your toddler about moving fast and slow. For more dancing fun with your little one, select the Dance Together option on the DVD menu. <laughs> when your little dancer is tuckered out, talk about moving slowly. Children of all ages will love to curl up in mom or dad's arms as they sway from side to side. And of course, babies also love live music. There's so much out there to stimulate the senses when people gather to dance and enjoy music together. Whether it's a street performer or a Sunday concert in the park, getting outside and getting moving is a great activity to share with your baby. All of these ideas will make classical music a positive experience for your baby and a terrific way to share beautiful moments together. Listen to many types of music with your children and make interaction an important part of that time together.